All right, so we are going to get your mouth watering with what's going on in Centerline today. Students at the Rising Stars Academy has spent years cooking up delicious treats and also learning some job skills. Well, now they are stepping up their game and making their debut at Little Caesars Arena, making a big time. Paula Tubman has been in the middle of the beehive of activity all day. Paula. Listen, there is a beehive of activity going on right now because they're getting ready for a big show. The students at Rising Stars Academy in Centerline are having one heck of a year, and the year is only nine days old. For eight years, this nonprofit has been preparing developmentally disabled adults to meet and greet the world with employment skills. Now, they do a lot here, but what they're prepping for tomorrow takes the cake. Make that the sandwich. At LCA tomorrow, while the Red Wings are doing battle with the Winnipeg Jets, these students from Rising Stars will be meeting their public face to face. We're uh, making all the bread here in our bakery, uh, prepping all the meats for it, sauces, um, everything from scratch, and we launch tomorrow. For years, their baked goods and sauces have been making the rounds in Metro Detroit. Bread and bakery products so fresh that they've barely left the oven before hitting the shelves and dinner plates of some 75 restaurants. But at LCA, a kiosk, a storefront of sorts of their very own. Delaware North, which contracts with LCA, is calling these folks up to the big show. They're so eager, so hardworking, um, and just want to be accepted, and, and that's that's really, really what sets it apart. Today, prep day, getting ready to sell specially taste-crafted artisan sandwiches made to order. The classic bologna, thick-cut bologna sandwich on a freshly crafted jalapeno cheddar bun with garlic aioli and cheddar cheese. The Don't Talk So Close shawarma starring that garlic sauce, hummus and pickles on a chicken shawarma wrap. The perfect pastrami on a fresh-baked, specially crafted marble rye ciabatta with red-eye mayo with just enough ting for your tongue. And the out of left field lentil cake burger, vegan brioche made fresh, pickled red cabbage and poblano sauce with a bit of crazy zing. Just working with this program has really gotten Amina out of her shell. Put me out there more, uh, take me out on CBI's, help me public speak more. Sometimes it's important to just go out and just feel like everybody else. And I think that that's what we really strive for here at the school is to make them feel like, you know, we can just go out, they can go out, and we can all, we're all the same people, you know? And when I asked Nadarwin what this experience is like for him, he gave the perfect answer. Feels like a rising star, you know? <laughs> Absolutely, there you go. Well, now these are just two of the sandwiches. Okay, true confessions time. My partner, Justin, and I, we, di we did eat two of them, Karen. Uh, but you know what, that don't talk too close, uh, chicken shawarma, it is for real. Only eat that with good friends with breath mints. It was good, real good. They will be on the main concourse at the Detroit house for the whole month of January, longer if you like them and they like you. By the way, Karen and everybody, Happy New Year. And uh, Justin, you got one, I got one left. The lentil cake one looked good. Did you try that one, Paula, or no? Are you stuck with the no, whole that's chicken shawarma? No, that's dinner. Okay. That's oh, wow. dinner. Oh, you're set. I can, send, I can send it back to you if you want to try it. They no. are, they're delicious. I'll, they're I'll... really good. I think they're going to do really well. It does look really good. So proud of them. I love I love the interviews. Thank I love how they, like, they gained the confidence, too, just in speaking with you. It was cool. All right, Paula, Agreed. thanks. Have a good dinner. <laughs>